Here's how to create marquee text in Canva. It's very easy to do, and if you'd like to follow along, you can click the link in the description to try Canva for free, or simply use it for easier login access. So when creating your design, keep in mind you might want a longer design here, especially if you want your scrolling text to move from left to right. So here I'm gonna do create a design, and after that, I'm just going to do a custom size. As you can see here, I have 2000 by 250. If you want to just do it on something that's plain, say maybe like a YouTube thumbnail size, you can do that. But for this example, I just wanted to showcase how you can create a custom design and make it a little bit longer. For example, this is a YouTube thumbnail dimension. And as you can see, the height's not going to be as tall, but this is going to be much longer. So let's do create new design. All right, so now let's add some text. I'm just going to do some normal text here. I'm going to do add a heading. Let's do marketing island. I'm gonna make it much bigger just for the sake of this. Okay. And assuming if you wanted to add more text to it, you could do something like, you know, YouTube, follow for more. I'm just adding more text to show you how it works here. Now here's the very simple thing that we need to do. Assuming if we clicked off, you would click on it, you would go to animate, now what we want to do is scroll down and probably the best one here is going to be drift. As you can see, that's exactly what we're looking for here. How it's going to move from left to right slowly. So we can click on drift here. We can choose the direction if you have Canva Pro. So this very simply will allow you to move it left, right, up or down and so on and so forth. We can do the intensity. So if you want it to be, let's see, I think that's going to be a little bit faster as opposed to this is going to be super slow. So we can change that around as well. These are going to be the two options that you can use. So faster, slower, left, right, and so on and so forth. That's going to be how you can set that up. And last but not least, what we want to do here is go to share. When you go to save it and download it, you can do download. Now you can do an MP4 video if needed, but you probably might want to do it as a GIF where it's more like an image. This is something that you can pretty much put anywhere, like say if you wanted to use it in an email signature or wherever it's going to be, right? It could be a banner if it's going to be this dimensions, but you would just simply want to click on download. If you do have Canva Pro, you can use a transparent background, check that off, but you would simply just download it and you would be good to go. And that's how you can create some marquee text in Canva. If you got any value out of this, be sure to give it a thumbs up as it helps me out a ton. And if you made it to the end, a virtual high five for you. I will leave a link for a free gift in the description that can help with building and growing your digital business if that's what you're into, of course. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.